but I'm not that far away. Well, the wind is uh, when the temperature gets to uh, 32 and 32 plus, it makes a big, big difference because it's not freezing. It's a wind chill, which it feels like, but it's not. It just feels like it. Oh, we got some deer. White tail. Cool. Running to my backyard now. Except they get there a lot faster. Got to get my mountain bike fixed. I know I've been talking about it, talking about it, but uh, for all my fans on uh, YouTube, my uh, seven subscribers, they keep growing. I only had a, a couple, none, in October. I've grown. As I grow a very successful YouTube channel, I'll be getting more and more ideas. Might do some cooking. I might do some facials. Where I talk, you know, politics, current events, history, mixed feelings. Ah. Sports. What a gift. The Bulls last night against the Cavaliers. Now the Cavaliers, okay, they've not looked really good lately. They did. I got a phone call. Got a check. I think it's my mom. not my mom. <sighs> Hello. Hey, Uncle Chris, how are you? Yeah, I landed. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I got my eyes peeled. You want to focus, right? Hatchback. All right. You you want a certified? Here, I'll call you back because I'm on my bicycle. I pulled over to answer my phone, but I'm out riding my bike. I'll call. Okay, bye. Okay, I had a feeling it was Uncle Chris.
Uh, he understands about uh, my lunacy with bike rides because he's seen me and Brett a couple times, you know, riding up to parties and stuff. You know, what we call our schnutz suits and our, uh, well, me, my outlandish colors. Like today, I'm wearing uh, yellow, orange, blue. Blue matches my bike, my bright orange vest, my East Bays. Which, uh, everything's working good. I'm a little nippy, so it's kind of cold. I could get uh, if I could get uh, a few miles out of this uh, today, you know, 15 would be awesome with the way I feel right now. I mean, I'm almost, I'm not even at the five mile mark. I'm starting to get cold. Might have been because I stopped for that phone call, but uh, let's see how long it takes to warm back up. Should be pretty quick because I didn't sit for too long. See how that cardio responds. <sighs> you know, because I'm a, I'm an Adonis. I've been telling people this forever. In my delusional brain, I am. Injury update. Groin is feeling better. Hand is feeling better. Keep stretching it. Started running. I'm so I start strengthening it because it needs. I need to put some type of weight bearing on that thing. I have now learned. I have determined that it came from deadlift. I had to go for uh, a screening the other day for work. He also made me pick something up 30 pounds. It's a, you know, one of those boxes. Here, squat, pick it. Holy shit. You know, kind of like a deadlift. Don't keep it close to your chest. Ah. And I felt my, that's where I got it. So, uh, I maxed out that whole exercise. Did the Superman. Touch your toes. Bring your knee to your chest. Some type of supine motion, you know, like one of those uh, shiatsu stretches slash yoga move. You know, it's like one of them Indian style uh, push ups. So, yeah, that all worked out great. Great shape. Because he goes, yeah, you know, they're going to ask you to pick up a, a 30 pound box. I'm thinking like UPS. All right, I'm going to pick it up and I'll do whatever I want. You want me to press? I'm thinking, yeah, it's got handles. It's kind of wide. It's not really made for every person in the world. That's definitely, uh, you know, not for a little girl. But for a smaller guy like me, that's that test isn't fair. To get me going on fairness tests, wow. The other stuff, okay, I could see, you know, touch your toes, supine, you know, Superman, touch your knee to your chest, okay. Usually women are more flexible than men. It's not always the case. I think it's genes. I really have to practice hard, practice very, very hard on flexibility. Uh, my sibling, sister, my younger sister, Evie, forget about it. She's as brittle as I am, as you know, like a diabetic. I'm brittle. She's brittle. She works on it, I know. She may be more flexible now after injuries. Never can't tell. Sometimes injuries really 
make you focus on uh, how to stay healthy and keep healthy and it sounds like she's really making a big comeback right now I know she's got my mom mom it's a good place to be Arizona right now ah, I'm not missing nothing got all this shit under control here which is not nothing to do like always okay I can honestly say now my fingertips are getting cold so we gotta work them get a little bit shaky it's okay though I'm at the six mile mark I know if I have to, I can hang out here for at least another half hour. Gotta get an hour plus, hour plus, that's the goal. So this usually works, alternate hands, get the upper body moving, gets blood into those extreme areas of the, uh, of the fingertips. Always remember when you can feel them, they're not frozen. And you can't feel them, woohoo! You know you got a problem. tobacco spider senses people watched Man of Steel the other night with Soph forgot how good of a movie it was gotta tip the hats to DC on that one Woo! really good also after that I did a back to back did a space jam I hate LeBron, I know he owns Space Jam, but you know what? I gotta thank LeBron. Because he got that Space Jam into the Walmart 788 bin for Blu-ray. I had a jump on it. So LeBron thanks. Thank you all. As I have been saying, for LeBron's whole career, for all these people who want to compare him to, you know who? MJ. The GOAT, the greatest of all time in basketball. Although if you make the argument for Kareem, Russell, Wilt, I respect your opinions. I won't argue. I won't. Most people feel it's Jordan. I know Dr. J feels other. I know Dr. J, uh, I remember watching one of his, uh, I know he had Russell, and I know he had Oscar Robertson ahead of himself probably because he's such a humble man so uh, it's always different eras you know the gear gets better the shoes get better 
people think, ah, oh, this uh, might doesn't make a it does make a big difference. I can tell you, being a runner, right shoe, and not the right shoe, huge, and huge, and the shoe technology is gone through the roof. Through the roof. Excellent. Okay, got to warm those fingertips up again. I'll keep talking because it's keeping my face warm. I deserve a big mood zone. Nah, for doing this today. I should have just ran. But again, my foot still hurting and I've been running a little bit. Uh, because uh, I can't ride and I've got a bike on the tracks now. I don't, it's habit training. Same with the treadmill, I hate it. Okay. Another phone call. Man! I normally don't even answer the phone. Uh. Alright, I'm gonna pull over and answer this call real fast. Or I'm gonna just check if it's not a big deal. I'm not gonna. Okay, it's my mom.